guest today, if you were listening to Q, you may know that Kevin O'Leary joined me here in Studio Q, the Dragon's Den Dragon, the money lover, the ubiquitous television presence, the business success story. Kevin O'Leary has uh, just published a new book about his life and his approach to business. is called Cold Hard Truth. In it, he conveys his personal philosophy that, you know, greed is good. We had a, an interesting, I dare say, feisty interview. I enjoyed having Kevin here. We heard from many, many of you who disagreed with Kevin O'Leary's outlook. This from Norman Dale in Prince George, British Columbia. Gian, a beautifully balanced job of not letting the bullish Mr. O'Leary get away with too much of his occluded and, I have to say, not very original version of neocon. I liked your defense of non-monetary motives, but I most enjoyed O'Leary's closing remarks about Canada's excellent position economically and its relation to our banking system. If O'Leary thinks that that system arose spontaneously from single-minded pursuit of money and had nothing to do with the financial regulatory environment created by government, he is delusional. Norman Dale, Prince George, British Columbia. Thank you for all your responses on this. Happy to read any defenses of Kevin O'Leary, if you want to send those in as well. In the meantime, Norman Dale and Prince George, you have the letter of the day.